The first thing that blew me away about Thai food was the flavours, and I'd never really experienced anything like it. It was the freshness, the vibrance, the fire in your mouth. It was fantastic. I like mixing the different cultural things and, you know, putting something else in and, you know, breaking it up a little bit. I'm John McClay, the head chef from Red Spice Road. It's all about sharing at Red Spice Road. Either, like, lots of little things or food out on the table, help yourself. It's a sense of community. I love it. For cooking Southeast Asian on a barbecue, the best thing, simple thing you need is the char grill part. A wok burner, if it's attached, would be amazing because it gives you so much more variety with what you cook. People overcomplicate food. You can't overcomplicate things, particularly if you're doing them at home. Keep it simple, keep it fun, keep it fresh, keep it vibrant. And that's what I'm going to try and show you guys what to do on the barbecue. What I'm cooking now is snapper filled with smashed prawns and green nam jim. To start with, we need our snapper. We're gonna lay it out on my banana leaf here, which I've already put on the grill to soften it. Get our smashed prawns, put a little bit of sugar in there. Not too much, just a little bit. Some green onions and some red curry paste. Just gonna mix that through. I'm gonna go crazy with the green onions here. I'm gonna go the whole hog. Gonna mix that all through together. We're gonna spoon it out onto our snapper. This is basically our sandwich filling. On with the coriander and another one of my favourite ingredients, the kaffir lime leaf. Incredible flavour. On with our top fillet. Now we've got a beautifully filled fish. Now we're going to wrap him up. We just grab a banana leaf. We're making a little parcel here and this will trap in a lot of the flavours as well. Grab the fish basket, in with the snapper, close the shut and on the char grill. We're going to leave our fish in here for about 12 minutes. This artiste is a four burner. So I'm going to turn them all up to medium so the fish cooks through slowly. Now we've got it sitting on 150, 160. We're going to turn all four burners down to low. Now we're going to make the green nam jim. First up, I'm going to start with the green chilies. We've got some diced shallot, garlic, now coriander, a little bit of palm sugar, fish sauce, some lime juice, and off we go with our mortar and pestle. We're just going to give it a taste, see if it's to our liking. Certainly to my liking. And there you have it, your green nam jim. It's been about 12 minutes now, so we're going to lift up the hood of our artiste and have a look to see how our fish is going. Yeah, flesh is starting to break away on one side, that's what I'm after, so I'm going to give it a flip. Ah, uh, yeah, beautiful, look at that. And back down with the hood again. It's been about 15 minutes, I'm going to lift up the hood, have a look and see how we're going. Feels pretty good. If you're a little bit uncertain, poke a knife in there. The juices should come out nice and clear, which they are now. Now for the hard part, lifting the fish off. <laughs> I'm using a cloth so I don't burn myself. Open her up, slide your spatula under, then carefully just easily work it off. Cut open the banana leaf. Look at that, looking beautiful. Cut a nice piece, once again using this sharp edge spatula. And look at that, looks amazing. Spoon over some of the green nam jim, scatter over some coriander, and there you have some fantastic snapper filled with smashed prawns with some green nam jim. Now that's the side of a great barbecue. <laughs>